by now you're probably asking what I'm doing. Well, I'm making a steel pan at Jimmy Phillip Pan Workshop and School in Shogonas. Since the creation of the first steel drum to now, technology has evolved and new tools have been introduced to perfect the art of making a steel pan. And Jimmy has embraced the new technology and he showed me the tricks of the trade from selecting the drums to sinking them. You can do it this way. Now on to the next step. So how long can get inside? About oh, oh, one, maybe twenty minutes or so. Okay, and what we have to do now? See now, now it's, it's, it's a little bit rough, so we have to take a hammer and just hammer and get on all the lumps here and smooth. Then Jimmy brings out tools he has created over the years to make the notes on the seal pan. Ali, this is how we will have to find the center. We will have to take the ruler, put it at a certain point, and draw a line and then go the opposite way and draw a line and the opposite way and then we make a box and then we X the box to find center. But with this now, you just set this up, you look through and it's center. Now to mark out the notes. Using position markers and exact measurements, then it's time for grooving the pan to aid the players. Then we cut the drum. And if you're wondering about the fire process, Jimmy explains why. Why are we putting the pan inside? Well, we have to burn the pan to burn out all the impurities, plus to temper the material to make it, you know, like hard to harden it and things like that for tuning. So we have to burn it and temper it. Okay, so how are So put it this, that way, yeah, this, this way, way, yeah. <clears throat> Jimmy Phillip is not only a master pan maker, but also a gifted player. He says he's been in a business for over 50 years. I met this pan tuner in 1970, Wally Sustin, okay. and he needed somebody to work with him. So I have little experience already, so I started working with him. And then I started to see and learn the, the real, how to do what. Because I used to groove and bust up the pan, right? Now the pan is ready to be cleaned and tuned. And this process helps ensure that all the notes are tuned perfectly. And then the final step, chrome. And after all the work is done, it's time to play a sweet pan melody. Otto Carrington, CNC3 News.